What is going on, Punkadilla Nation, and welcome back to the Punkadillans channel. Today we're going to be looking on how to install this more snow edit. It's not really a mod, but all it is is dragging a new environmental XML file into your modded maps. You can actually do the basic maps too. So here is your data for the basic maps. You really can't plow much, so I'm not going to worry too much about that. But to put it in to the modded maps, click on your folder. Here's when you download it. You got to use RA file or WinRAR to abstract the file. This is what it looks like. Very easy. So from here, this is Windows 11. So we go to My Games. And then for modded maps, you got to look for it. It's just going to be down here. And you can do this without unzipping it. So you go into your actual map folder, maps, map US, and then it's right here. So you just click and drag. I already done that. So, And then to do uh, the other one, you're going to click on wherever it is located or an easier way. So go to Steam, go down to FS22, right click on the actual bar, properties, local files, then it shows you where you have it, browse, and then this is your actual directly, here is the product line to find it, same procedure, you're going to go into data, maps, and then this is your US and then the other map I don't even know what this map is <laughs> oh that's the other map All right. so that's your three maps and then you know your modded maps are in your mods folder and then so you go in the US and there's environmental right there so you replace those drag and drop and replace very simple so now once you got that installed, it says you may have to go through one season. I didn't. I started. I was right in December, and it worked for me, and I got a shit ton of snow. <laughs> More than the plows could handle. I would probably, I would recommend using the metal press from CR Modding. You can still find it. You just got to search it on the other websites besides ModHub USA and um, some of the mod sites that he removed it from. But I will try to find a link that works for the metal press. Personally, if it was me, I wouldn't have taken it down. But he had to do it because of copyrights. And the other guy for saying that he was going to put it out. Well, this guy has no history of releasing anything. Went into his Discord and the release channel is nothing. So this guy has no track record of releasing anything. So this guy just needs to shut up and let people release that who are actually going to release. CR modding is actually gonna release for free so those are the people that we actually want we don't want none, none of this patreon bullshit and now as we sit in here that's just because of the terrain this is a stock map and this is what you get this is a lot of snow <laughs> way more than the stock alright guys we are back and I forgot that I still had the highways to plow so this is the the snow that we are dealing with when you get this new environmental XML file installed it is some pretty heavy snow and the bridges have different collisions <laughs> or I guess in that area but yeah look at this snow wow takes all of its power. Wood metal farm stuff can't get through this. You gotta bring out the big toys. This is the real snow plowing equipment right here. It's not like I'm going for a finish pass. I'm trying to get the majority of the snow off. 
But this is what you can expect when you let it go for a little bit and you spawn in a whole bunch of snow. This is when it's really fun. Right here. So if you guys enjoyed today's tutorial, make sure to like, subscribe, like this video as always because it helps the YouTube algorithm and make sure that people that are wishing that they had more snow could see it. So I do my part and you guys do your part. So let's keep her going. Let's get this channel back up to where it was. And I guess some things are having problems backing up today, I noticed. If anybody has issues reversing, I don't know if there was a recent update to Farming Simulator that messed with it, but that's a big issue. Or it's not like wood metal farm stuff is known to cause errors. So thanks again for being an awesome supporter, guys. 10,000 subscribers is amazing. Let's uh, shoot for 20,000 and beyond. Hopefully we can get to our 100,000 so we can get at least one plaque on YouTube. That would be amazing. Well, see you guys later. Have a great day, and let's hope for spring coming soon. We're getting there. It was a good winter, easy winter. Wasn't much to deal with, not like last winter. Peace.